All right, got a nice little generic um, general warm up for you um, just to get the body prepped. So I'm just gonna start with butt kicks. Nice relax in the shoulders, kicking her butt with her heels. And then she's gonna drop down on the next minutes because this is an imam. And we're gonna do a single leg glute bridge. So I'm gonna put one leg up, knees in line, and she's gonna drive through her heel, pausing briefly at the top for seven per side on the glute bridge. Then she's gonna switch when she does her next one, leg up, knees in line, and keep it nice and tight. Awesome. Then she's gonna flip over and she's going to do eight to 10 burpees, whatever she's feeling. We've done a lot of burpees in our warm-ups this week. And that's that. So that's our general. Um, after that, we're gonna to go to our mobility um, and we're going uh, ballistic leg swings. So these are nice and fast. Um, we're gonna go straight leg, front to back. So that's hip flexor, hamstring, hip flexor, hamstring. Moving back and forth, keeping the hip square. And then we're leaning over, going side to side, adductor, 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 adductor. Good. So what we're gonna do each leg on that, obviously. Um, and, then, and then we're done our warm up for the day, guys. Nice quick one. All right, today uh, we've got girls at home. Okay, so uh, Thursdays we've been doing a lot of benchmarks um, and we've been making like at home versions of them. Today we've got three of the most infamous CrossFit benchmark workouts in your home. Okay, so they're all 21 15 nines, which we've beefed up to 42 30 18s. Okay, and we're gonna start with the first one. Brand, all right? So 42, 30, 18 of odd object, whatever object or objects you have. We have dumbbells, uh, thrusters, all right? So hip crease below the knee and driving uh, those hips up into the dumbbells nice and hard. Then we're gonna stop, we're gonna put the dumbbells at our waist. We're not gonna let go of them if we don't have to. We're gonna bend over for 42 bent over rows. Elbows driving back hard behind us, squeezing through the scap. All right, and keeping that posterior chain tension. This is going to get spicy, okay? Um, we're, we're gonna rest until the 10 minute mark, and then we hit Elizabeth, okay? The different version of Elizabeth though, Elizabeth is cleans, um, and, and there's a squat clean version, a power clean version. We're going ground overhead, um, just because the odd object uh, is better for that. So we're gonna choose to do a snatch with ours, um, you can do a show like a uh, clean and jerk style. It's just ground overhead, but um, I would try to just get those hips firing and do uh, a ground to overhead in one motion being a snatch uh, for the most part. So we're going to ground to overhead. Make sure we're still using that hip action. We're not using too much arm because you will need them for the next movement, which is push-ups. So after 42 there, we are going to 42 push-ups. You will need those dumbbells again, you know that, right? Of course. <laughs> Why? Put them close. And we've got 42 push-ups, and we proceed to 30, and then 18 of dumbbells, push-ups, dumbbells, push-ups. Uh, then we rest to the 20 minute mark. At the 20 minute mark, we have our last girl, and that's Diane, okay? So if you have heavy enough weight, you can just do deadlifts, okay? Still 42, 30, 18, you can do deadlifts. Um, however, if your weight's not that heavy, you're gonna drop one. You're gonna go single leg deadlifts, which is an RDL plus a reach. Okay, so opposite hand on the dumbbell, you're gonna tap it just in front of your foot and come back. I would recommend um, splitting that up doing 21 on one side and then switching and doing 21 on the other, obviously so you don't overload one side. Then we're gonna proceed to do um, either divided by two, so 21, 59 on a handstand pushup. Cool, you can go strict, you can kip, whatever your thing is. Boom, okay? Uh, make sure you stay on the wall though. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we're gonna, or we can do 21.59 on that, or we can just do the old 42, uh, 30, 18 in a piped handstand push up if we don't have a, if a wall that we're, we're gonna wanna do. So piped, we're gonna touch our top of our head. Yeah, so just like a handstand push up, so best is just gonna touch. He's gonna stay piped the whole time. He's done these before, I don't know. There you go. 
So maybe maybe keep it a little tighter, Basky. So hold on, stop a sec. So stay piped up. Yeah. We obviously don't rehearse this stuff. So Bessie, gonna, he's, he's not gonna start here. That was a what not to do, okay? He's gonna arch back to the top of his handstand push-up. Okay, so get, get your head, go back to the start. Get your head through your arms. Good, okay, and we're just gonna do a handstand push-up from here, not a push-up, a hands, there we go. Good, so his top of his head's just gonna touch just in front of his fingertips. He's gonna press back through. Cool, and that's a pike push-up. Cool, so we got three girls. Um, do them nice and hard, do them nice and fast. Uh, it's a Thursday, so um, make it as metabolic as possible. All right, guys, have fun.